Well, the crowds are finally clearing out from the Covered Bridge Festival. Some residents are ready to roll out the red carpet to get everyone out of town. News 10's Dan Klein spoke with one resident who's excited her town can go back to normal. After 10 long days, Deborah Northcutt is ready to water her flowers in peace. She's lived in Bridgeton for more than three decades. She loves it here, except at this time of year when crowds take over town for the annual Covered Bridge Festival. It's not all bad. I mean, this, this brings in lots and lots and lots of revenue for the county that's a poor county. But even still, there are a lot of things she can do without. Tops on her list, root vendors and tourists, some of whom she says can block main roads for hours at a time in the weeks before and after the festival. This year, something new for her list, mail delivery. She's one of 24 residents who aren't getting mail during the festival. She now has to go to Rosedale to pick it up. It's real irritating, and the, the bill collectors don't understand that because I haven't made a trip to Rosedale be, because I'm protesting it. I'm, so she can carry it all out here Monday morning. And that's not all. She's tired of visitors letting their dogs do their business all over town, including in her yard and not cleaning up after it. Plus, while many residents block off their yard, she says some people will still move barricades and block driveways. So when Sunday evening comes... Celebrate, celebrate. <laughs> we can't wait. <laughs> so, yeah, we just look forward to doing it all over again next year. She knows some people are dependent on income from the festival, and she would miss getting some festival food a short walk away. But everything else, she can do without. Reporting in Park County, Dan Klein, News 10. We also contacted a few other residents. They didn't want to go on camera, but said they avoided traveling the week of the festival so they wouldn't have to deal with the crowns. But if you're one of the ones already looking forward to next year, mark your calendar. The festival is scheduled from October 14th to October 23rd.